What's up guys over here. This is going to be a short update on Quest of Seekers campaign on Linea Mainnet. It seems like last time I gave you some misinformation, so I want to fix that while we still have some time. And also I will show you what are prerequisites uh, to maintain ZK Futurist for as match task because I went uh, on Quest and Discord and there are tons of people uh, confused about that because instructions provided by mentor, not instructions, but link provided there is very confusing. It's not accurate, but we'll get to that in a minute. First, what misinformation last time I provided? It was regarding the rules. I completely missed this sentence. It states that after completing all mandatory tasks, you will enter the leaderboard. So it seems like unless you complete all of the tasks here, including on chain tasks, despite the fact that you have entries, you won't be on the leaderboard itself and therefore you won't be able to receive this NFT. I'm going to start with some cross-chain swaps and then we'll get to the bottom of the ZK Futurist SBT. So for cross-chain we got XY Finance and we, we got Symbiosis. I'm going to start with Symbiosis. Let's connect the wallet first. I already checked what routes I need to use. So I'll just go ahead and swap this. Uh, on Symbiosis I'm going to be swapping from ZK Sync Era into the linear. Okay, we got it. That should arrive well when it's gonna arrive. And on XY, let's connect the wallet. Here I'm gonna be using BNBs. We'll do like 0.22. These cross-chain swaps, in terms of fees, they're quite expensive. And both cross-chain transactions went through really fast, so now we can move on to OpenOcean, where we need to swap on-chain, on Linea. Make sure you connect the wallet here first, then make sure that you are on swap. And here, not much is available. We can swap to BNB, wrap ETH, or swap to BUSD. I'm going to swap to BUSD. I'm going to swap here 0 0.03, but again, 10 USD worth of uh, tokens should be enough. This is a bit higher than aggressive, but that's fine. Now let's try to verify and see, is this auto detectable? Okay, it was detected on OpenOcean. On Symbiosis, I cannot verify the XY for now. Okay, now let's move on to ZK Futurist SBT. So, like all regular SBTs on Manta, you can find it on this page. As always, you will need to connect your MetaMask, you will need to connect your Manta account. So, I'll show you first of all that I have it. Well, you already saw that I completed the task. And the guide states that in order to be eligible to meet this ZK Futurist SBT, you need to have three SBTs from Quest and Platform. And there is a link here on the Manta page. If you click this link, you get to this page. And as you can see on this page, there are four SBTs and they are all ended in 2022 actually. And that's why a lot of people are confused. Some people think that you should have done these SBTs at some point uh, in the past, but luckily this is not the case. If you go to your Quest account, on the left side here, you see your profile, your communities, then you see your claimed NFTs in Quest then, and then here on the bottom, it says achievements as soul bound NFTs in Quest then. So it works a little weird for my taste, but nevertheless, it's checking for these soul bound SBTs or soul bound NFTs, whatever you wanna call them. And these SBT achievements, you don't mean those you mean these NFTs. And these SBT achievements, they are tied, they are connected to their respective NFT. So for example, when I minted this NFT, I got the corresponding SBT achievement. For the mermaid, I got the mermaid SBT achievement. So in order to mint ZK Futurist, you need three SBTs. If you don't have any, all you need to do, you need to find campaigns uh, with these NFTs. For example, I'll link these three in case you want to do those. But first I'll show you how you can find the right campaigns for you in this case. So we go to explore and here where it says rewards, we need to select NFT rewards. 
Once you select the NFT, you have to manually check campaigns to see if this is going to be appropriate for you. For example, ZK era week. What is this? And here we are looking for campaigns where you can mint the NFT right away. These are usually campaigns with the badge AFCFS, meaning first come, first serve. So for example, all we need to do is visit this page. Now we can verify. And so after that, you can actually straight up claim this NFT. Also check what chain is it on. This one is on ZK Sync era, meaning that mint is gonna be a bit expensive. It's suggesting a crazy gas. Obviously, I would change the gas here, but again, I would suggest to find something like these three campaigns that I used. It's on Polygon, BNB, and then BNB. So again, I will link these three campaigns. First campaign is just purely Twitter tasks, and you can claim on Polygon. Then there is one for Tabby, and this is pretty much the same as it is on Galaxy. So you can claim that one too, and if you're not participating in Tabby, you absolutely should. I will put the link for Tabby in description as well. And the last one is Zeta Chain that you should also be able to claim if you did campaigns on Galaxy. This one is also good, for example, from Injective. Here you just need to have one Galaxy or AT, probably from Injective. Let's actually mint this one, and I'll show you that SBT is changed in the profile. Guess is a bit high, but it's okay. Okay, we got it. Now let's go to quest the camp again. And as you can see, I got the fresh new SBT achievement that is tied to my NFT I just minted. So this is how you get it. You need three of those. So three any NFTs you can find on the quest stand. Then you go to Manta, you connect your Mana Mask. Press the button, it's gonna tell you you are eligible, you need to have your Manta wallet connected too, then you can mint. It's gonna say that the mint is free, but it will also show you a KMA fee. It doesn't mean anything, the mint is indeed free, you don't need to have any KMA tokens in your Manta wallet. Once you minted that, you need to go to My ZK NFTs. It's going to show you the list of your ZK NFTs. In order to find your key, you need to click here, manage proof key, then approve the wallet, and you either create a new one or you can click original and it will show you uh, your proof key. Then you need to go to your Asmatch and actually connect that. So first you're opening your profile, clicking on edit. Then here's the button to flip the screen, you flip it, then you see your credentials. You just click add and here you input your proof key and you confirm and you're gonna be done. So that's it, that's the whole process. Then you can confirm your task right away. I actually went back and I was able to verify my XY transaction and I should be in the leaderboard. Nice, position 666, it's just my number. The deadline on this one is July 27th, 7 a.m. UTC time. That's it for this video, thank you for watching. Be sure to like and share the video. Subscribe to the channel if you still haven't. And I'll see you next time.